Welcome, folks. Welcome to Spellbound. Now, this is a game that I can remember being purchased when I first got my Amiga in the vain, vain attempt that I would actually try and learn while having a computer. I do remember this amazing theme tune, though. And it doesn't play for very long, but I do remember it. Now, this is basically a learning program. Kind of interesting. Um, I have a lot of happy memories playing this game, believe it or not. Now, is it going to work? I suppose it's the... Oh, there we go. Please insert data disk, and then press the any key. Well, I don't have an any key, but either way, we've got both the disks, so we're all fine. Now, yes, this was bought by my parents when they thought, I know, we'll get him an Amiga, and then we'll get him some educational programs. Not educational in that way, you naughty, naughty people. I've come for Mor Morgana's wand, that's what you think. You'll need these keys. Oh, God, that laugh. I remember that creepy laugh. So we need Morgana's wand for something? Not quite sure what we need it for. Ah, okay, so we've got to spell the word actor. That's easy enough. Now, what do you have to do when the game loads? You shoot things, and they drop letters. From those letters... Ah, good. First letter acquired. You have to pick letters up in the correct order. There's act, or ack. Now, was there a T up here? Yep. Ah, there we go, we've done it. Actor. That was easy enough. Then you just fly to the end of the level. Don't pick up anything else, because if you do pick up anything else, you will spell the letter wrong. The word wrong, sorry. And we don't want that, do we? Now see, what is impressive about this fish? That water does not look nearly deep enough to support that fish. Ooh, that's a lever ringing in your ears. So we've got our first key there, folks. Don't know if you saw that. Whoa, chill out! <laughs> My gosh! Thundering test tubes. Hal's Hal. Okay, so we're apparently a supercomputer. We need to spell needle, and that piranha should not have. Wait, I'm gonna say I thought that octopus was attached to the piranha. Then, okay, so explain the word needle. Come on, game. Load, load, load. I mean, what is kind of cool is. I mean, the kind of environments that you go into, they are pretty... I really like them. Well, I think it hurts. Ah, good. There's the N, E, E. And I have, you can actually move the letters around a little bit by shooting them. But one thing you've got to be careful of is that you can sort of... Uh, there we go. Need needle. Boom. I'll try and dodge everything else, but the problem is, is that you mean old shark. Now the problem is that if you actually shoot one of the enemies and they drop a letter, and they drop it in an area where you can't get past, that is the issue. Because then you have to pick it up, thus you have to spell the letter wrong. Do you have to be quite so loud? Stupid thing. Wait out for the Dr. Willy clone screaming. Wait for it. <coughs> Festering physics. Hal's found the second key. Poor old. I don't even know what this guy's name is. Certainly looks a little bit like Dr. Willy. Beetroot. And honestly, what the heck are we flying, is what I want to know. You can get easier levels, where basically you 
have quite small words to spell. Okay, so we've got an E and an R. Apparently we're getting shot at randomly. Boom, and he's dead. I like how we literally just kill like all the sprites here. I mean, why is everyone shooting at us anyway? Okay, we're all right though. So we've got BE looking for another E. And I think there was an E back at the start. B T R U Do the actual environments I pretty I like them. I think they're pretty. I think for the Amiga they're quite well drawn. For, and you got to remember, I mean well drawn for an educational game. Cuz when you think about it, this is one of those like rubbish games you used to get on the uh, school computers. Beetroot! Can we dodge him? Yep, we can dodge him. Well, you have to sort of question it. Why? Well, you shush! You have to question why, like, in an educational game, you are having soldiers shoot at you and killing soldiers and throwing them out of buildings. Thundering test tubes. I feel sorry for this guy. He's really freaking out that we're getting all the keys. Ah, uh, now, quotation, right? We're getting a bit more difficult. <laughs> now, I could actually fail this one. Um, I'll be pretty damn bad if I do, but hey, it happens. Quotation. Naughty snowman. Okay, so looking for a cube. I know I don't mean the, mean the one from Star Trek. What the hell is that thing? That just looks scary. Okay, it's got not even one correct letter yet. You mean, mean, mean thing. See, and now we've got an alien throw. I just do not know what we're fighting anymore. What the heck are we fighting? We've got everything in this game. Okay, so we need a U next. Ah, now, is that a U or is that a V? I can't quite make that out. I didn't... Oh, no, there's the U. So, quote... Oh, I forgot how you spell it. No, A... We need, another t we need a T, an I, an O, and an N. We don't have all the letters, folks. That's a bit mean. Wait a minute, if we don't have all the letters... Oh, never mind. My bad. Quotation... I... I, 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 I... Where's the I? I... Hold on, don't we need a, an O as well? We don't have another O. Uh, excuse me, game. I need an O, please. If this game is being mean and, like, intentionally trolling me, then it is succeeding. And I'm running out of fuel. Oh, there's the O. Now it's going to literally be a race against the clock. Quickly grab the N. And let's get out of here. Mission accomplished. One thing to point out very quickly. I love this thing for the rapid fire alone. And that really like screws up the sound if you're emulating. We are a successful speller. And we're going to land now. Stop being so high-pitched. Darn it. And get ready to scream. Dr. Willy Clone. One, two, three. Ah! <laughs>
Just chill out. I'm going to open that door and get a wand, and you can't do diddly squat to stop me, so get used to it. Kettle. Okay, looks like we're heading to a very, very pink Death Star. Kettle. That's, that's a fairly easy one, actually. Oh, my parents, so naive. I know. We'll get our son some educational software. Okay, none of those. Alright. See, he's just being mean now. It's not even... Oh, that was lucky. Cat. Now, I don't think... Oh, there was another T. Well, that was easy. I just need to get an L and I'm done. Because the E's on this screen. Yep. Oh, that's a mean place, gun. And honestly, what is the kind of... Who are we fighting? Kettle! Mission? Comp These enemies are seriously odd. Boom. Boom. Headshot. I do apologise for anybody's ears when that is doing that. Wait for it. Have we completed it? Oh, that sounds kind of creepy. I found the five keys! The world's a safer place now. Apparently. I don't know why the world is a safer place. Well done! You found all five keys and rescued Morgana's one from Professor Grime. Why not try again at a higher setting? Remember, the more difficult you make it, the more points you will earn. Well, I think it's stuck on that screen for the time being. But that was Spellbound. So a little bit of editing there, folks. Had to... It got a bit screwy towards the end. But anyway, this was... Spellbound, this was Strange Game Saturday. Thank you very much for watching.